News, Osibanjo, and APC Presidential Tickets. Hello, my wonderful people. A lot of persons have been speaking and have been saying, you know, in APC, a lot of persons have said Osibanjo remains the best candidate if they are going to talk about in terms of Nigeria having integrity, uh, leadership of integrity that could potentially steer this nation in the right direction. Some members in APC says Osibanjo is the man to bring to the table if they want to be honest and do not want to jeopardize their chances at the polls. Please do not forget to give us a thumbs up, like us, share, subscribe. Let's get all the details as Osibanjo is being promoted by some APC members. Looking at the Nigerian current situation and the caliber of APC candidates, it is clear that Professor Yemi Osibanjo is the right person for the presidential ticket in APC. If we keep aside and look back, if we keep aside sentiment and look back at his actions as vice president and the impact of his responsibility as overseer of social investment program during the first tenure of the administration and his prompt response to national issues why he was the acting president, that will surely testify his, cap his competence, credibility and good leadership style required to move Nigeria forward. Above all, his commitment in serving Nigeria is one quality that is not commonly found with most of our contemporary leaders and politicians seeking for political offices. He is a man with much passion for development, especially in the areas of economy, agriculture, infrastructure, human development. He is indeed an icon of social transformation who has no elements of enmity in his style of politics and is always willing to work with everybody like-minded who have the Nigerian heart in them. In the light of the above, it, I, Niger, an APC stakeholder, particularly honorable, honorables and delegates of the party, says he is ready to vote for Sibanjo and that the party must consider him as the flag bearer of the great party. Honorable Olalekon said Osibanjo is the best candidate APC can present if they really want to win and want to project a man who has what it takes for Nigeria to get to the next level. Nigerians cannot begin to look at things from just face value. If Nigerians truly want the change they've always desired, Osibanjo happens to be that man who could bring the nation back on track and save the dying nation from where it is right now. Yemi Osibanjo has served in various capacity and has what it takes to bring Nigeria to a desired position, if only given the opportunity to serve as Nigerian's president and bring about new innovations and transformation that could better the whole nation. Osibanjo has served Nigeria and wants to serve Nigeria again. And Honorable is asking that the delegate, everyone, consider this man who happens to be the best chance for APC to bring transparency and true governance to the nation today. Well, Honorable Laleko, uh, that's your position. Some other persons may think otherwise, you know, and everybody has their reason why they want, you know, certain people. Okay, some people are saying, Oh, Osibanjo. Some other person are saying, no, not Osibanjo. Whatever the case is, you know, parties will first of all have to vote. And we advise and we encourage that they get the best candidate. For instance, Labour Party, you know, we've seen to it that uh, Peter Obi has emerged. Peter Obi is one man who, you know, if we look looking at somebody who has the potential of transferring, transforming Nigeria today, Peter Obi seems to be that man. He has the, you know, the, the, the credentials to show for it. He can boldly tell you what he did, why he was the governor of Anambra State. He can boldly put it to you. This and this and this and this and this is what we did. These are the areas we, you know, we improved. This is what we did. And it's clear. It's not trying to, it's not patronizing you for goodness sake. It's telling you just exactly how it is. And when you look at it, you can tell.